Kaboom, the voice of the blockchain, Satoshi's big cousin, crypto's finest, Champagne Crypto, thank you for tuning in. In this video, I'm going to talk more about beearn.fi and the B vaults that were just introduced out there. But first, let me shout out all the Champagne Crypto Maniac Boomers. Everybody out there in the blockchain battlefield trenches, congratulations. The boom is upon us. Make sure you touch the buttons, the like, the subscribe, the post notification bell, the ding ding, button it up, drop a comment, and more. Let's get straight to it. I'm over here on uh, Medium reading about the B vaults. B uh, earned community. The, f the wait is over. B vaults is finally live. And uh, you can see the B vaults at beearn.fi slash B vaults. I was reading more about it. Uh, what are the vaults? They're basically yield optimizer, and you can see what pairs they're offering. Uh, the initial vaults that they are deploying or that they deployed just a few days ago are the BDO BUSD LP vault, the SBDO BUSD uh, LP vault, and the BDO BNB LP vault. More pairs to be added. Now, what makes this different than other uh, opportunities? B vault offers double rewards. So not only do you... Uh, have the opportunity to earn APY on the pair, on the liquidity provider token, but also additionally, you can earn BFI and BDO and even maybe a third coin details to be updated, says this Medium article. A 3% of newly minted BDO during the expansion phase will be sent over to the vault holders. And uh, you could read more about the tokenomics. Uh, let's look at the price of BEARN. Uh, I was just... Let me hit refresh over here on CoinGecko. Bjorn at 9.16. This is one that we've been eyeing on our watch list since about 250. Uh, we finally got in somewhere around 500, and this thing continues to uh, rise. One thing that attracted me to this coin is the low circulating supply. There's only 3,700 right now, and um, I don't think that's capped right now, but nevertheless, it's small uh, circulating supply, which uh, does attract me. Let's go over to the protocol so you can see what's going on. This is Bjorn.fi. Meet the cross-chain auto yield farming platform. You can click more about Bjorn and then read through the article uh, and the documentation, uh, which is important uh, if you're going to be uh, interacting with these protocols. So uh, the new products that they offered here is B Vault. So you click up here to B Vaults and you can see uh, the current APY BDO against BUSD, and that one's at twenty-two thousand APY, about one point four eight daily. Of course. This is variable and it can change. And, you know, as time progresses, uh, the APYs will decrease. Uh, and then you've got the SBDO BUSD uh, that pays uh, 282,000, 2% daily. This is probably the most uh, highest APY farm uh, that I'm involved with right now. SBDO against BUSD, again, 282,000 APY with 2.17 daily. This is better than what they're offering on Auto Farm. Auto, these are uh, actually let's go to Auto Farm. You can see the top uh, farms now on Auto Farm are the SBDO BUSD, uh, but they only offer here two percent. And if you go back, you know you got to go to the source because uh, you know the BDO. These are the tokens from their protocol. So if you go to the, the source, they're probably going to uh, offer a better rate. So let's go back and you see it is a better rate. It's uh, at BDO BUSD, let's try it again. BDO BUSD, hit refresh. BDO BUSD daily APY, you search it by daily APY. Uh, this is at 2.1. BDO BUSD 2.1 at 146%. And uh, right now, BDO. This is about the same. SBDO BUSD is at about 2.1. Now, the difference here between these two farms are basically about the same. Yesterday, this was a little bit higher. The difference is that not only do you get that APY, but you can earn the BDO and BFI in this uh, vault. Okay, so um, I was actually in that vault in Auto Farm for a while, but uh, I moved it on over. So you can see uh, I'm in both these vaults, BDO BUSD and BDO SBDO BUSD. Now, SBDO is the governance token for the B dollar protocol SBDO? Uh, last time I checked, was trading uh, above three thousand dollars. Okay, and this one is a low supply as well. So you can see uh, it's on a dip today, thirty-five twenty-two, uh, and uh, added more to my position late last night. So uh, circulating supply of eighty-five thousand uh, reminds me, you know, of you know Auto Farm and you know, ACS stuff like that. 
that have low circulating supply. This, you know, this token's already in the thousands, but perhaps it has room to grow. I don't know, but I am uh, leveraging uh, that asset in order to earn more B earn tokens and BDO. BDO is a stable coin. Okay, BDO is a stable coin. You can check this out. BDO. Uh, and it's it's not as pegged to the dollar as, uh, you know, um, other stable coins like BUSD and, and uh, Vi and Tether. In fact, it's actually worth more, a uh, $1.35. Okay, so, you know, uh, something to consider. Right now, B dollar is actually worth than, more than the actual dollar. Uh, but this is a rebase token. If you guys know anything about rebasing, uh, this has a different method of rebasing than most rebase tokens. There's bonds or whatnot. You may want to uh, read it, but and nevertheless, that's the price. And uh, yeah, I just want to let you guys know about these vaults, guys. These vaults are, are quite attractive. They just opened up five days ago. Uh, this BDO BUSD vault offers 16x rewards, which is attractive. And then the other one, 8x rewards. So uh, real simple. Uh, you know, you go in there, you put the LP. You guys should know uh, the, the deal by now as far as the farming or how, how it goes. Uh, but that's what I'm doing, guys. Uh, there is a 6.9 performance fee. But that performance fee, most of that goes to... Uh, those that are staking B stake uh, B uh, BFI the the B earn token and you could do so once you earn it okay you can earn it here in these farms and then you can go back here and just stake the single asset you could stake the, I got one staked over here and that, you know the APY is not as attractive as the the vaults and the farms but uh, you know it's fifty three so you can keep count co compounding and again this this APY is paid from uh, the games profit the vault farming rewards and extra. Uh, so you could go ahead and, and uh, you know, read more. I'll be, there's a referral link actually. So I'll be dropping the referral link to the beearn.fi ecosystem. So if you guys want to link on over and, and snoop around, uh, the link is down below. And uh, they also got the B play, they, you know, and then they got B farms, uh, which I talked about a few uh, weeks or about a week ago, pancake against BNB, BFI against BDO. And this is a little different. Uh, but right now I think what's hot is the B vaults. Okay. So, uh, you know, 16x, 8x on the rewards there. You get two double rewards. It's, it's quite interesting. So uh, I'm going to give this a whirl and, uh, you know, I'll let you guys know how it's doing. But I'm attracted to this coin with the low circulating supply and the extra high APY. Uh, so, you know, drop a comment. Let me know what your opinion is. I do want to repeat, I'm not anybody's financial advisor. I'm not anybody's crypto daddy. This is strictly for comedic and entertainment purposes. Hopefully you guys are having fun watching uh, the champ here experiment with these protocols. Drop a comment below. It's the voice of the blockchain. Big cousin crypto's finest. Champagne crypto. Thank you for tuning in.